Eighth grade, unit one, lesson six, describing transformations. Number one, here is trapezoid A in the coordinate plane. A, draw polygon B, the image of A, using the y-axis as the line of reflection. Here I've drawn polygon B, the image of A, and I've used the y-axis as the line of reflection. B. Draw polygon C, the image of B, using the x-axis as the line of reflection. In green, I've drawn polygon C. It's the image of polygon B, and I use the x-axis as the line of reflection. C. Draw polygon D, the image of C, using the x-axis as the line of reflection. Here you can see I've drawn polygon D in red. It's the exact same shape as polygon B. Number two, the point negative four and one is rotated 180 degrees counterclockwise using center negative three and zero. What are the coordinates of the image? This red point has the coordinates negative four and one. And this purple point has the coordinates negative 3 and 0. Rotating 180 degrees counterclockwise using the purple point as the center, the new coordinate would be negative 2 and negative 1. After the rotation, the point would have the new coordinates negative 2 and negative 1. So the answer would be C. Number 3. Describe a sequence of transformations for which triangle B is the image of triangle A. The first sequence in the transformation would be a translation two units to the left and up two units. And the final transformation in the sequence is a reflection over the y-axis. Number four, here is quadrilateral A, B, C, D. Draw the image of quadrilateral A, B, C, D after each transformation. A, the translation that takes B to D. The image moved to the left so that B lines up with D. B, the reflection over segment B, C. The image shares segment BC with ABCD. C. The rotation about point A by angle DAB counterclockwise. The image is rotated so that the side corresponding to AD is now part of segment AB.